Have you ever been scammed on the internet? Well, today I have an interesting story for you. I was almost scammed on the internet. Hello guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Flash and this is Beauty Secrets. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. And if you're a new subscriber, well, welcome to join. Now, the internet has a lot of information. However, most of the time, it is also very easy for that information to be used against us. So, one of my favorite, favorite, favorite YouTubers of all time is Patricia Bright. And I follow both her platforms on the break, as well as her other platform called Patricia Bright. Now, recently, I am watching a video on the break. And, you know, I'm just, I'm just falling in love with the video and I really appreciated the message that she was sharing. If you know Patricia Bright, she is very, very, very transparent with her information and is always willing to share with us because we all want to grow our platforms. However, this one time, I got a response from the Patricia Bright and I was so excited. You can really see from the responses I was giving that I was really, really, really excited. You just imagine your icon responding to your message or your comment on their YouTube video. How would you feel? Definitely, definitely excited. However, things turned out to be different. You know why? Because it was not Patricia Bright. It was, it was fake. So, I got this message and you know, the person kept on chatting with me, telling me how adorable my comment was on the video and that they felt like they wanted to help me out and link me to their administrator so that I could join BTC. Now, I don't know anything about BTC. Eventually, I got to learn that this was cryptocurrencies and I don't know anything about online trading. I don't know anything about cryptocurrencies. So this was totally new to me. However, the message said, clearly tell the person that you have been referred by me. So I felt like, okay, Patricia Bright wants me to get in touch with their administrator. Like, like how amazing is that? However, the more I kept on getting these messages, I kept on chatting with the person. They asked me, uh, do you have any knowledge about you know cryptocurrencies? And I told them, no, I really don't know anything. So I was just doing my due diligence, trying to understand what cryptocurrencies were. Now, where I jump off the train is here. The person specifically asks me, how much have you prepared for this? And I was asking myself, hmm? prepare for what? Like I didn't sign up for anything. I didn't even ask for this. And I've just heard about cryptocurrencies. How have I prepared enough? How? Like now? To cut the story short, I was actually really considering putting money into this thing. And the only reason why I was ready to put money into it is because I felt like it was coming from a credible source. And I felt like it was coming from the Patricia Bright. If the person had not asked me how much I had prepared to invest, then I would not really have been tipped off. And it's then that I went back to YouTube and I checked the comments. So I realized that when Patricia Bright actually comments on your post or your comment, then her name or the name of the channel is actually highlighted in gray. Now I checked the channel that commented on my comment and I realized that it was actually a fake account. When I clicked onto it, it had one subscriber one subscriber and later on one of the followers of patricia bright also sent me a message and told me hey you know what this is really fake so do not fall for it however if it was too late and i had quite figured it out at that time so i'm just imagining there's so many people who are unsuspecting on the internet and we get so caught up because we have so many people that we follow and icons that we love and it's very easy for you to lose your consciousness while you know you're engrossed in all this content that you're consuming so i'm just sending a message out there for all of us as we use the internet as we use youtube that anything related to do with money and you have to invest please do your due diligence check the page check the information make sure you verify every single thing 
Now, I appreciate the fact that I got in touch with Patricia Bright and she was able to give me feedback that she has noticed this and she has reported it multiple times. However, YouTube is not really doing anything about it. So it means it has to be people. If you see anyone responding to an account that you feel like is not real, please, please, please send a comment. I would like to shout out the lady who responded to my comment and tried to let me know that this was a fake account. I really appreciate that. And I hope that we all look out for each other on the internet in the same way. Well, thank you very much for watching my video. Please feel free to check out my other content and leave a comment if you find value in any of the videos and make sure that you give this video a thumbs up if you've been able to get value and leave your comment in the comment section below. Let me know if you have ever had the same experience or if you have ever noticed and given a heads up to someone having the same experience. Thank you for watching. Until next time.